it's just it's the whole idea that anybody who does anything profitable in the world whether it's stocks you know or whatever it all kind of rolls back into real estate in some fashion or way you know i mean if you're a rapper or whatever you end up buying real estate um and the tokenization of real world assets um we need to figure out how we can get real estate onto the blockchain and i think pulse chain would do quite well in that space so adam yeah dude it's it's coming bro i think the problem with that stuff is you the licensing you know how strict it is to get your license you have to keep up with your education every two years and i think until legislation is in place that stuff it's it can't thrive like we we know it can so that and now in an election year i don't know if they're gonna be really rushing to push stuff through but you never know but again that's opportunity you know, like Propy mm -hmm. is one of the ones I think of right away that comes to mind. I know that they're, you can buy and sell and list stuff on there as NFTs, but I feel like it's, it's, it still is very early and it's going to be a huge opportunity. I think on Pulse Chain, especially, we have a lot of these launch pads coming and these incubators where people that don't know a developer, they don't have a clue how to even start. You can just come to one of these like Pulse Launch or, um, Corey Costa was uh, interviewing one of the another one the other day. I forget the name of it, but all you need now is an idea, and you submit it on a website, and these projects will bring it to life for you. So I think someone has a, a creative idea with a project like that, it, it can happen really fast. So I think it's it's just only a matter of time before it, it does come.